Well, that was something. <laughs> okay, so it went live with no sound. Um, not ideal, not ideal. So I'm gonna have to uh, fix that. So and... I'm gonna have to uh, fix that. Oh, there's an error. So I'm gonna have to uh, fix that. Oh, there's an error. There we go. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna have to fix that because there is a song with that video. So thanks for watching anyway, and I'm gonna have to re-upload and reconfigure everything. I don't know how that happened. Totally was good on my end and totally fine on my end when I checked yesterday. So not sure guys, but thanks for hanging out and thanks for watching. Um, I am going to go grab my hard drive so I can fix this right now. And, um, oops. and I'm just going to play some music for you as well while I'm going to grab that stuff. And um, yeah, I'll be back in a few minutes. Yeah, thanks guys. I appreciate it. If you're no worries to stay back, I'm gonna to have to um, do a couple of things to figure that out. Um, yeah, kind of strange. I don't know how that happened, but you know what? It feels like 2022 is just uh, the way that things go, <laughs> and it's never um, the way it plan. It, the, it never goes the way it's planned, seemingly. So. You know, that's just how it goes. That's just how it goes. Anyways, um, but yeah, so I'm going to just run out and grab my hard drive. I'll leave you with some, I'll leave you with some music from, let's see, what can we play? Let's play like an instrumental version of something. <laughs> I know. Hey, Philip. Yeah. So yay to premiere a video and have no sounds. Kind of a bummer. Um, trying to take it in stride. <laughs> Things happen. I know. And it's not always the most wonderful thing to happen, but you know what? That's okay. So I'll play some music for you. I'm going to run out and grab my hard drive. Thanks Arwen. I appreciate that. Um, <laughs> All I can do is laugh. <laughs> Ain't sure. All I can do is laugh um, because otherwise I'll just be sad. <laughs> so, how's everybody doing? Um, so, I'll be right back. I'm just going to um, go grab my hard drive. It's out in my studio. So, yeah. Hang out for a minute if you want. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, Arwen. I hope so. I don't know what, I don't know what happened there. I'm not sure. What do you think happened? It's just 2022 shit. Thank goodness for Char. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back, guys. Um, just hang out and chill. You can just look out the sunny window with Char and enjoy. I'll be right back. <laughs> Char, you stay there. Oh no, Philip, that sucks. I hope you have like some supplementary heating.
It is so cold. Holy moly. Can BOI FYI. Don't know what that means. Bye, Arwen. I'll try and pop on shortly. Arwen is a dance teacher, does wonderful classes. So I'm going to try and uh, get this video set up, guys. If you missed it, I premiered my new music video. There's no sound. So we're trying to troubleshoot that now um, while we're hanging out. Philip, man, I hope you get some uh, hope you get some heat. That is not good. That is not good. <sighs> okay. Let me just grab a coffee while this loads, and I'll be right back. Hope everybody's doing good and hanging in there. Thanks for hanging out while we're just troubleshooting. There we are. Oh, very strange. Hmm. Very strange that the... Okay, what's happening here? Yeah, tonight is gonna be really cold. Space heaters are hard too to heat up a whole room. Maybe you can, maybe, you know what would be a great idea? If you can find an electric blanket like maybe the local store has one. They're pretty great for just keeping you warm. <sighs> okay, I'm just gonna turn off that. I think I found it, guys. I don't know why the um, audio would not be here. Okay, so it's there. <laughs> so now let's try exporting this again. Still can't believe YouTube did me dirty like this. Seriously, seriously. Um, not cool, YouTube. <laughs> Export file. We're going to re-upload this babe, bad boy. Um, sounds like export file. <laughs> All right. Everything looks good. Everything looks good. Hmm. Oh, I see. Uh, it was set to export for some reason to YouTube with video only. Okay, guys, <laughs> I have uh, solved the issue. How did I miss that when I exported it last time? Yikes, rookie mistake, rookie mistake. Anyways, I'm <laughs> glad you're all hanging out. <laughs> I haven't gone live in a while, and it's nice to just hang out. It's been a while. Monday morning when you got up, the power went out stayed warm. Oh no. Yeah. Shoveling is so much energy. I shoveled uh, a little bit yesterday just to get it all cleared before the, um, before it froze today. And it was yeah a good amount of, good amount of uh, calories burned. Most definitely. Most definitely. All right. I'm going to have to upload this bad boy. I wonder if I can actually just replace the video. I know that you can do that on, on um, Vimeo. I don't know if they're going to let me do that on on YouTube. Let's see. Let me see. Oh, 
Oh my goodness. Guys, I can't believe I can't believe it. I'll be right back. Getting a coffee. All right, folks, so it says that it is exported properly. Um, now let's see if I can upload it. Thank you guys for hanging out. <laughs> hey, Billy Z, thanks for hanging while I troubleshoot. Trying to sh troubleshoot, uh, unfortunately, <laughs> the previous video that I premiered was uploaded with no sound. Um, very upsetting. So I'm gonna have to uh, fix that. <laughs> so silly. Um, yeah, so silly, so silly. I'm just gonna edit it. Yeah, unfortunately, like, unfortunately YouTube doesn't let you replace the video. Like Vimeo lets you replace the video in case there's an issue, but it's more of a professional thing. So maybe YouTube is not as, professional in that way like they don't want you to you know have one video that gets a lot of views and swap it with another one i get that just want to make sure this has sound Fun. okay great we got sound <laughs> still can't believe i did that i don't think i've ever done that before ever all right <laughs> Jeez Louise, now it's um, uploading. <laughs> my oh my, guys, my oh my. What a shit show, to be honest. Hmm, <laughs> so funny. All right. I think it should be... Uh, I think it should be good in a second. And then I don't know if anyone's gonna watch this again, but we will see. Oopsies. All right, it's out now. <laughs> oh boy. When the premiere of the video has no sound. Oof. <laughs> hey, Brock. How's it going? I'm doing pretty good. Other than the fact is I <laughs> premiered that music video with no sound. So we are uh, just re-uploading it so everyone can watch it. <laughs> I throw. Uh, how are you doing, Brock? What's new? How's life? I feel like the last two years has been a whirlwind, eh, for everybody? So um, I feel like I don't even know what happened in the last two years. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> Feels like we all should get that time back. <sighs> anyway, this coffee is delightful. Does anyone else use an AeroPress to make their coffee? Oh, Char. She must always have a cozy seat. Ma'am, I don't have a lap at the moment. You don't have a lap at the moment. She uh, does not like when there's no lap. She'll try and get under there. <laughs> Sneaker. Can't reach the computer, girl. All right. Oh, my gosh. This is where it always gets a little complicated to do anything on the computer. Oh, yeah. Winter weather is beautiful. It's actually been so nice to get the snow lately because it feels like real winter, eh? And especially up north, um, that must be really nice. Probably stays a lot colder all year or all winter long, so you can actually enjoy stuff. You can enjoy. Um, I went snowshoeing this week, which was great. So nice when it was like super snowy. 
and uh, not too cold. Today is pretty cold, but really icy. Uh, <laughs> all right so i'm gonna get the new link up for you guys and then um hopefully everyone can take a look at the video with sound i would appreciate that <laughs> and i'm just gonna uh save the other one as private because i don't yeah private done and then take it out of the um playlist oh my goodness what a mess up <laughs> all right let's um let's get this going can you hear char snoring yeah going from the desert to uh to winter is pretty different so i hope i hope you're enjoying it. it sounds pretty awesome sounds pretty pretty awesome okay folks let's uh i'm gonna share the link with you all so you can all watch the video <laughs> with sound this time i would really appreciate if you um if you did watch the video again and if you give it a thumbs up, because I think, unfortunately, all the stuff from the previous one is going to be gone. And, you know, bummer. Bummer. I'm going to delete this one. <laughs> oh, geez. So funny. So funny. Um, I don't know how to get it in picture in picture, but... I am not running stream hubs at the moment at the, uh, right now. I suppose I could for this, but we could just watch it together if everyone clicks <laughs> clicks it. <laughs> I'm gonna edit the uh, title here. Watch my new music video. Thanks. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing everything live time and it's so weird because this is something I never do. <laughs> I never just see my mistakes in real time. <laughs> but here we are. Here we are. I guess I'll just hang out and have my coffee with you guys. If anyone has any fun facts they want to share, I'm here for it. I am here for it. Of course, I made a mistake in my tweet. <laughs> Too funny. Too funny, guys. Oh my goodness. Too funny. Da, 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 da. I would be curious to know, if anyone's watching, what do you like to use to listen to music? Because I'm always um, kind of getting a gauge on what people are using these days. I personally have been switched, I switched to Tidal recently. Um, hi. Just because on the back end, they pay artists a little bit better. So I've been trying to support them and use that, pay for that. Motorcycle. Um, but I do think that they could have a little bit more development of their actual interface. I don't really love it. 
And Bandcamp is still my favorite, of course. Hi. Hi. She's just snoring. She's so warm and cozy. Okay. But I know a lot of people are still using Spotify. Um, most, I don't know, a lot of people are using Apple. I'm not really sure. Hi. I'll just do a live stream of you sleeping. That's pretty much the live stream. Just Char sleeping. <laughs> there you go. Can you hear her snoring? Yeah, I feel the same way with the UI. Um, like I like Title a lot and I want to support them, but they just, their UI drives me nuts. And uh, I'm still using them because <laughs> I just feel like I'm really trying hard to use Title, but their UI drives me crazy, especially their mobile app. It's really, really hard to have um, like select things and find stuff and the, the discoverability I find is not great. Bandcamp is my favorite for discoverability. It has the best uh, ways of finding new new stuff and new music. It makes me feel great when I see it because it's, it's nice. And I get notifications that people find my stuff too through the, um, through the discoverability of it. So I'm hoping that that continues. But yeah, Spotify is, still has a great UI, but not a great um, backend for sure for artists. Thank you. 
Let me find that video link for you. Um, <laughs> it's gotta be available now. It's gotta be. Um, maybe I pushed the wrong one. Oh my goodness, come on now. There should be the right link. That should be the right link. The other one I made private so that it wouldn't. Um... Does that work? Let me know. Should work. seems to work sweet you guys liking the char stream i'm just going to finish up my coffee here and then we will say goodbye
Hey friends, I'm back for a few minutes here. Whoa. Um, I actually use an AeroPress, Philip. Uh, it's pretty great if you haven't heard of it. Oh, sorry, I'm blocking Sweet Char Baby. I'll have to come over here. There. Yeah, because they want you on stream. Um, yeah, I use a pour over, or sorry, not a pour over. I use um, uh, AeroPress, and it works basically. Uh, yeah, Balzac's, Balzac's espresso is really, really good. What do we have right now? I think we're Which using actually dark horse sets from Christmas. I could get approved for with 100% certainty. Oh, I wish I was this ad? Get out of here. Like whether or not this get out of here. Details. There's sweet char. Um, yeah, we're using dark horse right now, which is a little intense. Like it's a little uh, bold. But yeah, AeroPress is the way we do it. In this house, it's just easier. And it's usually only one person at a time making coffee. Because I think if I had like a big um, coffee, like carafe, I would just drink way too much coffee. And it's not good for me. I drink good decaf most of the time. Over. Most of the time. And then if I want to get a little wild... Kalita Wave, nice. Yeah, the pour overs are nice systems. To be honest, I wish I could have like a massive espresso machine and I could make like <laughs> delicious lattes all the time, but I'd probably just become a coffee addict and like drink way too many lattes. I had a latte this morning when I was on stream with you guys and I just made it here with my, the best purchase I've made in all of the last two years of COVID was a little battery operated um, milk frother. <laughs> it's like the best thing. I bought it right at the beginning of the pandemic in um, in 2020 and best thing, hands down. That and the Instant Pot are the things I use like all the time from the pandemic. And no, I shouldn't get, I shouldn't have too much coffee because I, you know, I've got enough energy as it is. <laughs> it's like raining me in on a regular day is pretty like, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a challenge. So, oh, guys, I still can't believe that that premiered with, um, with no sound. And I literally like actually spent time and shared the link on TikTok and all the stupid shit that I don't usually do. So now it's like everywhere is going to have the, <laughs> the wrong link and it's probably just going to all go to that private video and I can't change it because YouTube is so silly that way. But maybe I can uh, see what's up. Yeah, I'm glad you relate too, because now you can actually see the real video. Um, but yeah, it premiered with no sound. Not great. <laughs> Subliminal Frother. That sounds like an amazing band name. <laughs> The good thing about my TikTok is nobody watches it, so <laughs> no one really cares. <laughs> um, I'm so glad you liked it. I'm so glad you liked it. It was really fun to make. I made it like literally a year ago, um, and it's just been in my editing folder, kind of just waiting to be to be uh, edited. And finally, finally, I got it done. Decaf blues. So decaf blues by soy latte. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. Um, yeah, so silly, so silly. I'm just gonna edit this link so that it goes to the right video. Not answering it. <laughs> Not answering it. Probably spam. Pretty much everyone that calls me all day long, it's spam. They just spoof the numbers. It's not cool, man. It's not cool. Oh, that's awesome. Congratulations. Tell me about the internship. What kind of uh, industry or like, what are you doing? That's really exciting. Congrats. It's probably a uh, going to turn into a pretty cool job. Usually internships are pretty good at employing you after. Oh, now you want to be on my lap again. This dog, this dog, you're such a suck. 
You are such a slut. Yes, you are. She just can't get enough. You cannot get enough, eh? Ooh, data engineer. That's awesome. Lots of work for data engineers everywhere, all around the world. It's kind of like the best job you can have right now, I think. Are you sure you don't want to be in the sunbeam there, Char? I think it's better. It's more comfortable there. I don't think it's good up here. Oh my goodness. There you go. Let me in the sunbeam. There you go. You stay up there. <laughs> See that look? She's like, excuse me. Awesome. Well, I don't, I think you'll be just fine. I think you'll get a job uh, and be super pumped and have a great summer of employment, which is going to be great. Yeah, of course, don't screw it up. You'll be fine. She loves being in a sunbeam. And this spot is like the sunbeam central. Yes, to move countries. Lots of uh, lots of awesome places around the world to explore. That's for sure. That's for sure. I can't wait to uh, one day be able to travel freely without worrying about <laughs> COVID. Yeah, yeah, she's fluffy again. I know it's been long enough. We haven't streamed where she uh, her hair grew back. She's no longer a shaved little baby. She's a floofy little baby. Ooh. I don't even know what that means, Philip, but I assume it means a data engineer. <laughs> Jupiter notebook system. That's pretty cool. What it can you tell me what that is? I was gonna say, of course they have to spell it different for patenting. Jupiter. Should I look up what that is? Jupiter. Jupiter. It's an original web application for creating and sharing computational documents. Oh, so it's like an operating system. That's cool. Hmm. Nice. Oh my goodness, you guys are all going to be able to like talk about talk tech. <laughs> I'm not going to know what you're talking about, but that's okay. That's what we're here for. Community building, data engineering. <laughs> All that good stuff, you know? All that good stuff. Interactive spreadsheet. I love spreadsheets. I'm really into spreadsheets. I feel like they organize my brain in a great way. In a great way. Um, but yeah. Hmm. Let's look into it. It's an IDA, a really nice place where you can code. Hmm. This all sounds very interesting. I may have to look into this Jupiter. Hmm. You guys are intriguing me as I read about it. <laughs> hmm. And writing code comments in real time. Hmm, that sounds like a really good teaching tool. I wouldn't even really know how to start. Ooh. Coding Python. You know what? Back in the day, I used to code a lot, but I kind of like lost uh, because it's always like the technology is always like, you know, being updated so often that I don't know how to use Python. I think I like literally stopped knowing how to use code um, like HTML5. So I was really into it as a kid. Me and my dad used to like be into coding, but very basic like HTML things. Um, once it got more complicated, like where there is more scripts and more things like Python, I'm lost now. So I just let people, um, I just work with people that know how to do it. <laughs> Which is great because it keeps you guys in, in business. It keeps you guys going. So. Which is great. Great. Look how beautifully sunny it is today. It's very cold. Poor Philip. I hope your heat comes back on. Um, Philip lost his heat today. But yeah, it's cold out, but beautiful blue skies. This is like a classic Ontario weather. It's like freezing cold, but blue blue skies and like just icy so icy cold <laughs> out there i went outside to like go grab the hard drive to re-upload that video that had no sound 
and it was uh, it was a pretty far walk <laughs> to go get it. Um, what is the temperature right now? I'd have to check. It is currently, I'm going to guess it's like minus, yeah, it's like minus 18. Not too bad. Minus 18. <laughs> Pretty chilly, but it's been colder lately. But I'm sure you can't picture minus 18. <laughs> hey, John, what's up? Welcome to the chat. We're just hanging after a video premiered that had no sound. And then we had like a little uh, healing hang. <laughs> minus 21. Oof, yeah. I mean, it might be a little colder than minus 18. I just kind of looked at the quick, the uh, digital thermometer. It's not always accurate. Yeah, that's cold. Yep. And I'm sure it's probably like, it's probably at least 20 where you are, Nilex. We'll see. I was just want to call you Ono. Oh, Ono. Oh, oh, hello, sweet lady. <laughs> You're very high. Okay. <laughs> Glad. Glad we can be of assistance to you. It's 21 for you. Oh, nice. And it's minus 21 for most of us. <laughs> We're talking Celsius too. Yeah. You like no, it's, it's pretty easy to say. It's very phonetic. <laughs> Look at that sweet, sweet jar. She's trying to adjust her sunbeam. So what's up, John? What are you, uh, what, where are you watching from? Outer space. <laughs> I'm all about, you know, just keeping everyone chill here, keeping everyone chill. Um, P5S, the JavaScript processing is Jeff code. Huh, that's kind of cool. I honestly wouldn't even know where to start anymore. Like, I just don't know. Czech Republic, ah, Dobrze uh, Dobrze, Dobrze, I think, right? Yes. I remember it's the opposite of Polish. Dzień dobry, Dobrze. <laughs> you got it. Welcome, welcome. I'm in Canada. And we have people uh, from all over the place. Canada, the US, India in the chat right now. I do not know much Czech. <clears throat> I know a little Polish and it's very similar to Czech. Um, so that's can say a few things, but no, I don't speak Czech. <laughs> I have enough to um, to speak a lot of languages because of touring. So I would learn a lot just touring different countries. Because um, when you're there, you need to ask a few things. You need to be able to say, hi, thank you. Where's the bathroom? You know how to order a beer. Um, I like to learn how to say this next song is called, and then I can say the title of the song. So all that kind of stuff is good to know, good to learn. But yeah, are you having a good day, John? She was having a good day. Chalk full of surprises. Well, I should probably like, I guess I'll end this live stream soon. I don't even really know what we're doing. We're just hanging out online. Um, just uh, shooting the shit across the Atlantic. Um, listen to some music and hopefully everyone's enjoying the day. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, yeah. I'm going to finish some work up today on I'm working on a short film score, and I'm excited it's almost done. So I'm looking forward to finishing that up. So that's what I'll be working on today, as well as waiting for, um, yeah, just going to make some good, it's an almost phone call, I know, seriously. Aw, <laughs> uh, thanks, Philip. Yeah, I'm glad, too. We can keep you warm while you're trying to figure out how to get your house not so cold but yeah lots of blankets and if you have um is the power out or just the heat out like is it your all your power or can you plug something in do you have a hot water bottle if you have hot water still although yeah your hot water tank probably still has some hot water in it 
if it's not an on-demand system, like with gas, you might still have some hot water. You could, you could, um, hey, could you light a fire? Is there like a fire pit nearby? Do you have a, oh, just the furnace. Okay, cool. So you can like, you can warm up, make a really hot curry or something and just like hold it and sip it. It'll warm you up. That's what I usually do. I make a lot of curry in the winter. I made it every day this week. <laughs> oh, on demand water. Okay. So you might not have, well, if it's gas, you might, you might be able to fill up a hot water bottle to keep you warm. But yeah, I'd say the, the trick is hot curry. Yes. What are you curious of? The curry that I enjoy? There's a local, oh, an Indian curry. Well, I buy all of the spices from the local Indian food shop, so hopefully it's authentic. Um, I use all sorts of spices, and I usually mix it with vegetables, potato. Um, no, they're not always spicy. Sometimes, like, a, um, I find, like, alu gobi or panak paneer is not super spicy. They're pretty mild. I love paneer. I buy paneer all the time from my favorite Indian shop, and... I sometimes make spicy curry. The spice mix I have from them is very spicy, so I use a little bit, but then I use curry paste. It kind of depends. I like like a warm spice, but not a spice that is like burning my tongue where I can't taste the flavors. But I love curry. I could eat it every day. I pretty much do eat it every day. My blood is half turmeric at this point. Yeah, I love, I love curries. Um, but yeah, no, they don't all have to be spicy. Depends. Baked beans is good too. Hmm. Yep, it's true. <laughs> She's snoring. <laughs> Guys, we watched Mr. Bean last night. It's been a while. <laughs> Has anyone watched Mr. Bean in a while? It is pretty awesome. It still holds up. I love that there's no speaking pretty much. And, uh, it's just like very physical comedy. Ooh, fish curry. Oh no, it was very heavy then. I actually have, I have some fish in the freezer that I need to use. And I was thinking about making fish curry. Um, cause yeah, it's usually tasty. What kind of fish does your mom use? I think I just have like, um, some sort of like small white, like it's like a, now what is it? It's a pretty fishy fish. It's just a little white fish. It's just in the freezer, been waiting there for a long time. It's probably like, wouldn't taste very good, I think, unless it was in a curry or like some sort of stew. But yeah, anyway, Mr. Bean was a great, great thing to watch last night. If you ever feel like, I mean, John, if you're high, you could go to watch Mr. Bean. <laughs> it's like perfect. Catla. Catla fish. What is that? Let me see. Catla fish. Catla fish. Oh, it's actually. It, that's the name of it, actually. It is in Bengali. It's uh, this. Oops. Nope. That didn't work. That's Bengali for Catla, right? <laughs> it's an Asian carp. Interesting. I wonder if this is the one that uh, we have an invasive species of fish here. And it's some sort of either like, I, I can't remember if it's an... Panini? Paneer. Paneer. Did I say paneer? Paneer. Yeah. Paneer. 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 <laughs> okay. I'm just going to turn myself crazy. Paneer. Panini. Paneer. Did I say, what did I say? Paneer? Paneer. Kind of sounds the same. <laughs> it's like, I can feel the difference in my palate of where I'm putting the emphasis on that, on the vowel, but I love paninis and paneer. <laughs> so we can do it all. We can do it all. Well, guys, I think I'm going to end this stream because we've been on for an hour kind of just talking about nothing. <laughs> um, 
but it's kind of like my favorite thing to do. And it's like a little bit less pressure than playing music on stream for the moment. Right, Char Char? Yeah. And um, yeah, I need a haircut too, guys. It's been a while since I, I'm getting this like one long ponytail. <laughs> it's gonna be another time for a quarantine cut. But thanks for hanging out, everyone. Uh, please go watch the video. I'm gonna post, actually I've pinned it up at the top there so you can see it. Um, let me see if I can, there we go. So please go watch the video. Leave some thumbs up and some good vibes. Nice to see you. Well, nice to chat with you, Philip. Hope your heat gets back on soon. Thanks for hanging out. And I'll actually, thanks for hanging out. And everyone else that popped in, I appreciate it. And uh, <laughs> I'll see you guys later. <laughs> thanks for this weird, uh, super weird stream with me in the dock. <laughs> it's been a trip. It's been a trip. I don't know if I should leave this on my channel. <laughs> it might be kind of confusing for a lot of people since Char was pretty much um, on there. Yeah. One day, I hope to tour again soon. Who knows with COVID? I'm trying not to remember. I'm trying not to think that it's forced me into early retirement, but at least for a little while, not live, but maybe on, on, maybe on the internet soon. I hope so. I need some encouragement. I haven't been feeling it lately. Okay. Bye everybody. Have a great day and um, take care of each other.